newer games with uh, that are bigger will take a bit more time but this one isn't usually too slow so wait a couple of seconds until it tells you it's done and it's at work right now um, so I'm just gonna run around like an idiot uh, whilst this is doing it's probably nearly finished anyway uh, what do I want to talk about um, I hope to do a couple more things. I will be doing a version of this uh, with C++ hopefully in um, a couple of weeks. Um, but the next one I hope to do this on a game like COD 4 or um, something more difficult obviously. Uh, and it will be a more covert method so it will be uh, through DLL injection which is um, you know obviously less difficult to be caught with. Um, but yeah it will be something like that. and. Um, Hopefully, I'll have some a stronger maths in there, which will be uh, used for other games as well. So hopefully, that's that's going to be good. Um, and uh, yeah, come on, scanner. So it's gone for just over a minute. Uh, I don't have to cut the video and then go back to it because um, I don't know. I probably should do that though. If it doesn't finish quickly, I will cut it. No. Come on, come on, come on. The problem is as well, I kind of have to fight, I've been promising my, to get myself a new hard drive for quite a while now and I keep forgetting to do it, uh, well, I'm kind of broke right now because I'm on holidays, but um, as soon as I get a chance I'll buy a couple of terabytes so I can do videos more comfortably. Oh my god, come on. Screw you, bitch. I still got a ton of health. Yep, I'm definitely cutting the video. Screw this. Okay, so um, I had to uh, do um, close the game there quickly. And basically, here's my thingy done. It took about four minutes to do this. This was ridiculous. More uh, newer games will take longer as well. Uh, so the faster the computer is, the faster this will do, obviously. Um, uh, I went and took a quick break there and watched some Steve Wilkos. So that was a bit sad. Uh, so I'm going to watch that. Okay, so I'm um, just going to actually close calculator. I don't really need it for now. So once you do this, um, once you do a pointer scan, what you have to do is uh, restart the game. So you close the game and you restart it. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just loading the game up again. Da -da 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 -da. Sorry, fraps there. Just checking it. it's okay. So run a salt cube again. And going to do that. Uh, apologize for any um, crying you hear because I'm. Um, I usually do this when my family's not around, but my uh, new nephew um, doesn't enjoy me making my videos, so he likes to cry during them, which is uh, definitely great because my mic picks it up. So um, there you go. Uh, so what we do now is we start a new game. We do everything we did before. So this may seem like a lot of work at first. So you go bot deathmatch, two players, and we're going to go to that map again because I like that map. Um, and you start a new game again. Now what you need to do again is you need to attach the the game, the uh, cheat engine to the game. Always say yes to keeping the current address. Do a new scan of 100. We're going to look for the health again and we want to do that. Take a couple of shots at them. Make sure they don't go for health because if they do then uh, it might screw you up. Oh, that's a lot of address the second time. We do that. Oh shit, I went for increased. Sorry, should have been decreased. Uh, decreased. Oh god. I have screwed it up. Probably screwed it up, that's for sure. Oh, come on, how, how does this increase? Alright, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill his ass. Oh, he's killed me. I'm gonna kill him and then I'm gonna go for 100. So I screwed that up there. Uh, wait for him to respawn. Damn it, come on. There he goes, respawn, do a scan for him. And I'm gonna go for decreased value. Did I shoot him? I don't know if I shot him. I'm gonna shoot him again, actually. Oh, come on! He's killing me every time. Bullshit. Fuck you with your shotgun and shit. I killed him now. I'm gonna have to put my. Uh, ah, God. Alright, so here you go. Let's go back to 100. Sometimes this will happen. It's really crap. Uh, so take a couple shots at him again. Screw you, you idiot. Decrease value. That's why it's recommended to use hotkeys. I usually use hotkeys, but. Oh, let's fucking kill him. So it could be any of these addresses, actually. Let's wait for one to reset to 100. We're gonna reset to 100, you know, in your own time. Oh, there you go. There's one that's at 100. I don't know if this is his address. Now. I'm gonna put it to one and take a quick shot at him, see if it kills him. Oh, come on. 
Alright, so, um, yep, that didn't seem to be it. That wasn't it at all. Alright, so I'm going to use my hotkey to look for, um, if you guys would like to do your yourself, because that's what I usually do. Um, I should have told you guys about this earlier. If you go on edit, um, and then go settings, and then go hotkeys, I usually choose for my uh, next can increase value. I have the plus on my numpad, and then for decrease value, I use the minus, so that way I can check in game much quicker. So I'm going to kill this guy and then do a new scout. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, come on! Look at this! I choose bad, and these guys are actually pretty fucking good. Look at that. Tears my health in like a second. Oh, fuck's sake. Alright, guys. Um, I'm going to have to do this. So, if you see on the files that I gave you, there should be a console trainer, which is a trainer that we did for how to hack in game tutorial. And this bot can suck dick because I'm tired of him killing us. So, kill this you crap bastard. I'm trying to make a tutorial bot screwing me up. Alright, so I'm just going to turn that on so I get unlimited health just so he doesn't kill me and I can do this properly. So, he's respawned by now. Uh, so he's reached one by now, we check for a hundred of his health, and then when um, we shoot him a little bit, we press the minus key on the keyboard. So hopefully I won't kill him, just give him a couple more shots. Press the minus key, shoot him again. Minus key again, and hopefully that's his health at 55. There you go, so I killed him, and then you get this big ass number. And then wait for it to reset to 100, and that way you know it's his. Put one health on him if you like, just to, just to check with one bullet you kill him. Um, so let's get rid of that. And um, what we do now, uh, we do, we do, um, yeah, we're going to go double click this address, copy it, and we want to go back to the uh, pointer scan here, and we're going to go rescan memory, and we put that new address in. Okay, and then just write 2. Doesn't really matter how you write, and then save. And now this will be a much quicker thing because it will find, it will reduce the number of addresses you've got there um, based on what, what was stored before. And there you go. So you get 44,000. Next thing you got to do again is close the game. And then you restart the game again. Close this if you like. You restart the game again. Oh. Alright, so I'm just going to load this. Bring this here. Um, so once we've got this many things, so I'm going to load the game again. I'm just going to keep this window open now because there's a lot of things that we need here. I think that's why it's called Files Required. But um, me as usual. Screen things up, I guess. Alright, so I'm just going to minimize this here. Oh, God. Alright, so there you go. So we've brought it down to 44,000 results. Actually, that's 447. Oh, there you go. So let's just um, let's just go and um, you know go start a new game again. Do the same thing again. But this is how point scan works. You just have to go and do it, do it, do it until you've got it. Obviously, more complex games sometimes you need to go like 20 levels and so on. But um, this one isn't that bad. So obviously, it's good to do and again like this and that way. Oh, come on! Just shoot me straight away. Actually, I forgot I was invincible. Alright, so kill this guy. I'm gonna do a first scan straight away, new scan as usual. Gotta to attach it to the game again, don't forget that. Yes, always keep the current address list. Uh, I'm to look for his 100 health, which is what he's got. I'm gonna put a couple of shots in him, I don't know if I'm hitting him. Here they go, I hit him there. And take a couple more shots at him, do it again, and it's gotta be one of these values. There you go, killed him. And it's usually always, as you know, that one. Uh, so that's our new value. We gotta go double click that, copy that, and rescan pointer. So pointer, rescan memory. Uh, okay. Um, once again, guys, if you want to see this, if you're not understanding this point scan concept, it's something you must know when you're dealing with things like this. Because um, finding out pointers manually can be, you know, a lot of trouble. So we brought it down to 236. Now we're just gonna. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, what we're gonna do? We're gonna do it again. Obviously, so close again. Start the game. Where's my game at? There it is. Start the game again. Not much you can do. So uh, last time I checked, I've used up over 100 gigs of um, thingy, and I've only got like 150 left. So hopefully, I can fit that in the rest of the tutorial. Otherwise, I'll have to uh, make breaks in between and deal with the uh, videos, unfortunately. But hopefully, I'll be able to do it. So. And two players once again go to this map, which is the one I like, as I've said like a hundred times. So we're gonna do a new scan. First thing, have I attached? Make sure it's attached to the new client. Yes, first scan a hundred. I'm gonna go after him, put a couple shots in him, and um, so there you go. Make sure he doesn't run to that health pack. Do a quick check, and my guess is that he's got 55 health or so. If not, 
Uh, yep, that was the one. Double click it. Uh, click on the uh, new address here. And we want to go rescan memory. Rescan memory. We'll put that number in. And we want to call that. So we've done one, two, three. We want to go for four. And save. So as you see, we brought it down to 403. Now, around these numbers, you can actually uh, find it. But we want to go just one level uh, deeper, hopefully. So we want to go close that. Start it up again as usual. Close these because they always create a ton of them. And uh, yeah, so obviously, this is a simplification of the actual process. Obviously, when you're doing this um, in your own scenarios, you will spend more time most likely doing this because I kind of already know what's going on because I've done this a few times for this game. Um, so we're doing it. So we start a new game. Uh, we're going to do attach again as usual. Oops. Do the touch first and then check for his health. First scan, and there you go. We found a hundred. We're gonna take a couple shots at him. It's not even a point of me talking. I've gone over this so many times. I'm sure you guys know what I'm saying now. So, see, he's gone for health. So, I'm gonna make sure we put a couple more shots on him. Check for less health. Don't pick up health, you idiot. Oh, kill him. Crap. Uh, 180. Uh, what am I gonna have to do now? To be honest, it's probably one of these addresses if I look properly. Um, so I'm look for a hundred now. So we're doing. Oh shit! Shouldn't have done a new scan. Should have just scan for a hundred. Um, but it doesn't matter. Shoot him a couple of times as usual. Oh, stop shooting him again. Uh, there you go. He's probably going for that health pack. And if he is, shoot him quickly before he gets that health pack. Oh, kill him. All right. So we're gonna do a next scan at exactly a hundred because that's where he's gonna be. So wait for him to respawn. He's respawned. Oh come on! <laughs> I always do. I always do that. Oh my god! I'm such an idiot. You guys probably got it by now, I just can't believe I screwed that up. So I've been used to doing this so much recently, it's... That can't be it. Did I get it in one? Oh, I did. How did that give me just one? That was lucky. Alright. So we're going to double click that value as usual. Uh, we go there, rescan memory. Hopefully this is our last, last rescan necessary, so do that. That's five. Let's do five. And we have three. Oh, I need to do one more, actually. Let's do one more. So close the game. Because 372 is still quite a few of them. Uh, start the game up again. And this is definitely the last one. Well, I don't know if it's definitely, but it should be. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Deathmatch. Bad. Um, two players. Oops, I went in the wrong map. Crap. I want to go cheat engine. Attach. Like always. Uh, yes, keep the current thingy. Do a scan for a hundred. Put a shot or two on this guy. Usually, the way I see it is the faster you do this, uh, the the more addresses it cleans out. So obviously, it's the first one. Um, we're gonna double click it. Keep that address in memory. Uh, we're gonna rescan it. Uh, and we're gonna go for six, 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 six. And we get 350. That is crap because it only took took it down by 22. So what I want to do now is I'm gonna just click on these. So um, there's a chance I can get the wrong one. Damn it, my nephew, fucking loud. Um, so yeah, I want to double click on one of these. Uh, just gonna do let's say the first one. And when you double click on them, it gets they get added to this list here. So as you can see that they're pointing to the scan result, and it gave me two different values. So. Um, now I keep that one there. I'm going to do another one. I prefer the ones with four offsets because they're usually more accurate. Uh, I'll say four, six. See, let's try this one. Four. Yeah, look for. Oh, that's a lot of them. I don't know if I want to do that. Just. So there's a couple of them here. Let's just stick to the first one. That one should be fine. Um, yeah. So that's all right. Yeah, I'm happy. Happy with that. I mean. Um, as you can see, it gives it's almost always an F4 here. So what we're going to bring this down is a 3-0, which is to start at the coordinates that we want. So there's that one, and that should be what we need. So what we're going to do is going to restart the game, and if those are right, they'll um, they'll give us the same numbers again, or at least should give us the player's health, the enemies that is. Uh, so minimize that. Go back in the game. Move the game over. Uh, single player bought deathmatch, bad uh, two players, gonna go here, and hopefully these will match the player's health. If they don't, we're gonna have to rescan. Actually, I need to attach first. Forgot about that. And uh, yes, 